That's right. why we come back to the scripture. Right. We wake up out of the dead state of mind. And we don't get to wake up our brothers and our sisters. Yo, King, you know where we are about that? Three. Isaiah 52 and verse 1. Away, away. Put on that strength, O Zion. Away, away. Put on that strength, O Zion. The Lord said, if you are awake, awake, put on in righteous strength. That's right. Put on his armor. That's right. Come and stand up to the heavenly Father. No, make nobody come push me over. Because we are not push over. We are man of might. That's right. So we have to put on the strength of the Lord, man. The Lord said, awake, awake, man. Put on the strength, man. Put on the garments, man. Come for the word of the Lord. Because, yo. The servant of the Lord is out here. Dishing it out. So come on to the plate and make sure to get full of belly full. Read. Put on thy beautiful garments, O Jerusalem, the holy city. And henceforth they shall come, they shall no more come into thee the uncircumcised. Right now the Lord has only have a change in the wheels, man. That's right. And come back to him. Clean. Right. And good up, good up. Just like how he make good man. That's right. We are the best people created by the hurt, man. Yes. But yet still want to walk out. I feel like they want to eat some That's with right. some parasites and crosses. <laughs> right? Why? Yo, listen, man. We can't take some look of buying people, you know. Right? Because no fellow man look of buying whole boy. Right? And they're ready. Right? And some woman don't miss them and walk around with. Them they're ready neither. Because they look like sitting one put in a hole, man. <laughs> We have to call back to people to the marriage because the Lord married them to us, man. Right. And tell us to stand up in our mind. We don't speak something like that. Shake them. Shake them. Isaiah 52 and verse 2. Shake thyself from the dust. Arise. Two minutes. Two minutes. No, sister. You're from Ghana, right? Do you believe in the Bible? Are you shanting? No, I'm shanting. Right. Anyway, you are meant to be. Now, you from Ghana, have you ever heard about the Israelites? Right. So who are the Israelites? Eh? You don't know. So who do you who do you believe that you are a children of Israel? If I read the Bible and it, you believe in God. But you are not call you. What what they call you in this society? Christian. All right, we're gonna show you when they call it Christian, yeah? Give me Acts 11 and 26. We're gonna show you these things. Come in, man. Come in, man. How are you? She's the leader. Are you the leader? Huh? Read that. Acts. Read that. 11 and 26. All right. All right, sister. Our people and boy, I tell you. They have. I said, but yo, not a can to knowledge. And them have small attention span. Them have the brain of a pigeon, man. Right? Over there, over there. Before you read, before you read uh, Proverbs, get the Proverbs. Proverbs 8 and 32. Proverbs, Proverbs chapter 18, verse 9. Here we go. instruction. And be wise and refuse it not. Well, Lord, sir. Hear instruction well, and be wise, wise and, and refuse, refuse it not. not. We have to hear instruction and be wise and refuse it not. Right? Don't make these nations tell them we're going to serve Christmas and bring Christmas to their yard. That's not wise. That's not of the Bible. That's of man laws. Right? Hear instruction from the scripture. Refuse it not. Read on, King. Blessed is, is the man that heareth me watching daily at my gate. You see that? Blessed. 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 It's a blessing. Blessed is the man and woman that hear the scripture and wait daily at this gate, man. So that simple means daily you have to open the Bible and come get understanding, man. That's how you have to get blessed. 
We see no further walk past. Please, and he must step high. No one left him higher than high. But all kind of cigarettes, all kind of ganja split, all kind of metal bean, all kind of crack cocaine. Right? We go be high by the scripture, man. That's right. Because we are here to tell our door daily to get more knowledge, man. Right? Read that game. Blessing is, is the man that heareth me watching daily at my gate, uh -huh. waiting at the post of my doors. Waiting at the post of his doors. Read that. For whoso findeth me, findeth life. But the Lord said, For whoso findeth me, findeth life. The Lord said, Whoso findeth me, findeth life, man. So, yo, we are some new breed. We are the whole stock. We are new people. We find life in that scripture. Not for the Christian church I teach. Because the Christian church talking about Jesus. Jesus is a real church. That's right. When Kerry come up, Kerry the Sea, Kerry come up, America, Kerry all over my place. That's Jesus. We find a Machia. Yeah, how was that? That's right! And that means he got to deliver us. Right. Because if we don't keep on calling Jesus, we don't go back on the boat. Right. But we tap our right. That's right. We come in to a match here. Yeah, how was that? Because he's going to deliver us. That's right. And we're waiting patiently on his deliverance. That's right? right. We know him. For whosoever findeth me, uh -huh. findeth life. Wait, sir. For whosoever findeth me, findeth life. Find it light. Sister, you want life? Are you one day? Free. And shall obtain favor uh -huh. of the Lord. Are we going to obtain favor from the Lord? That's going to make you feel good, man. That's right. I don't know about you, but you feel good. That's right. Right? Have you ever found favor from the Lord, man? Right. And I'm the brother, and I'm the sister, who mindful of the Lord, will find fear by the Lord. That's right! Because of the scripture read, man. Carry it out. But he that sinneth against me, but the Lord said, but he that, that sinneth against me, me uh -huh. wrongeth his own soul. The Lord said, he that sinneth against me, wrongeth his own soul. Right? Now give me two of it, chapter 12, verse 10, man. The Lord said, he that sinneth against me, Rang it its own soul, sister. A life we are given. You think we are given then? Eh? Look at this. You understand this? You understand, sister? But look at this. Can I show you two scriptures before you go? All right, come here, sister. Because this is what the heavenly Father calls you. Give me the book of Jeremiah, chapter um, 6 and start at 2. Sister, you are special. Where are you back going from? Jamaica, see? Benjamin. I'm a Benjamin. I'll be a Benjamin there. Right? All right, now we'll find another Benjamin sister. Right? Bring on that. Jeremiah. Jeremiah chapter 6, verse 2. I have likened the daughter of Zion to a comely and delicate woman. Lord say you are beautiful. Comely. You're beautiful and you're delicate. No, you need protection. No, you have a husband. Well, if you have a earthly husband right now, the Lord has protection. So you have to come back to the heavenly Father in truth and sincerity. Now, all you do that, yes, Kali sister, we have to mindful of what the heavenly Father said. Give me the book of um, Psalms, chapter 190, and start at um, 60, you know more, 61. Right. Read that man because sister look like she really she have that spirit. Because you have the spirit be a witness. Read that. Psalms first of Psalms 119. Yeah, read that. 119 and 16. 59. I thought I thought on my ways and turned my feet. And to thy testimony. But the Lord said, you can think by your will and turn your feet unto this testimony. Read. I made haste. I made haste. The Lord said, you must make haste. 
and delight not. The Lord said, I cannot delay. Right? Because as we delay, give me the book of Syrah, chapter 7, verse 12. Read. To keep their commandments. What did I say to do? To keep their commandments. Sister, you hear about the commandments? How much commandment they teach us? How much? Two the I like that. You jump over the ten. You put that ten more. You understand? Because yo, sister, I'm 630 in the Because basically, we have dietary. We have work for wheel, but we're not supposed to wear. Right? This one my garment is called fruit. Look around. You see how the brothers are now. Sister is not time to say. Because this is what we're supposed to do to our generation. Read them a card. What's the card? Seven, twelve. Chapter seven and verse twelve. Device not the lie against thy brother. No, seven and five. This is Ecclesiasticus chapter 5 and verse 7. Make no tarry to turn to the Lord. Make no tarry to turn to the Lord. The Lord said, Don't wait, sister. Read. And put no off from day to day. So you can't say, No. You know, so this is the brother that's from the Sabbath to the Sabbath. You can't put it down from day to day. Tomorrow, Sunday, you still can't go tarry with your body, your body, right? Read. For suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth. For suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth. So we don't know what will happen tomorrow. So not for us to make preparation for tomorrow. But at the end of the day, and the heavenly Father is the one that makes things really happen that we can see all tomorrow. You understand? Because the heavenly Father himself is giving Proverbs 19 and 1. Because we see you going, but we're going to show you this. Proverbs 19 and 1. And in thy security thou shalt be destroyed. So if we be like so we are gonna do our own thing, in our security or in our house and feel like we're alright, then you come sit this come upon you. A pain come upon you, they say you want to see the physician. When you go to the physician, he can't help you. He tell us I'm a pretty lad. Right? But give me Proverbs 16 and 1. Read that. Proverbs 16. And one, uh -huh. the preparation of the earth in man, and the answer of the tongue is from the Lord. You see that? The preparation. You're going to say something to me, and sister, and the Lord give you that inspiration for some of Jump to verse 3. Verse 3. Commit thy works unto the Lord. The Lord said, Commit thy I works unto, unto the, the Lord. Lord. Read. And thy thoughts shall be established. Anything you want in your life. Commit your works unto the Lord. Tell the Lord where you are going. And the man will make you establish it. If you're being sincere and do it. Sister, one thing they never teach us. We are going to teach you something about what we wear. Don't get upset. Because we're in the know. Get us to know. You understand? Give me the book of uh, chapter 9, chapter 1, and start the key. And give me the book of um, Deuteronomy chapter 22, verse um, 5. And give me um, where? No, more on Zephaniah first. Read Zephaniah. Zephaniah, read Zephaniah. And it shall come to pass in the day that the, of the Lord sacrifice. And when we have the Lord sacrifice, you know what I mean? When we have the Lord kill him. Read. That I will punish the princes and the king's children. Right, so we are the prince's children. Right? Read. And all such are, are clothed black. And all such as are clothed with strange apparel. So the Lord has said, all of us who clothed in strange apparel. No, apparel means clothes. Apparel, apparel means the mindset as well. You know, if we stuck in this, we have this world. Vanity, vexation and spirit. We have to stop in the way of the heavenly father. Right? Read the next piece of the Deuteronomy 22 and verse 5. 
The woman shall not wear which pertaineth unto a woman. Uh, the woman shall not wear which pertaineth unto a man. It said, a woman must not wear it what pertaineth unto a man. What woman wear what pertaineth unto a man? Right, sister. This is the Bible. Right, read that. Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. So if we, as a man, put on a woman's garment, we are cross dress. So the woman out here cross dressing and don't even know because society wants us to stay in sin. Do you know that you are both all women on the earth? You are the woman who will believe the next woman? But look, they are going to let them want to you to leave you. They want to leave you to destruction. Because the Lord God, you God God Zion. You are this. Not all people. The Lord met everybody. But in a view of the impurity. You understand? So that's why He gives us instruction and us to keep His commandment. Please. This is a history book, sister. Right? Give me Romans. Romans 8, verse 16. No. The Spirit itself bearing witness with our spirit. That we are the children of your hour. You understand that? Because you stop by right now. Your spirit be a witness. So believe what we are in, right? Your spirit be a witness with our spirit. So we know so you are part of the children of the heavenly father. Right? Read. Go to verse 8. Verse 8. So then they that are in, in the flesh cannot please God. If you are going to walk and think about how you feel. You can't please the Lord. Read. But ye are not in the flesh, but in the spirit. So we have to deal with the spirit. You understand that? Because, yo, the spirit be a weakness in our spirit. That we are the children of the heavenly father. So whatever we do, we have to do it in spirit and in truth. You understand? Read that. Titus. This is... Titus chapter 2 verse, verse 3. That age woman likewise, that they be in behavior as becoming holiness. So you know what holiness means? Set apart. We. Not the first accusers. So we can have daughters out here talking against each other, beating on each other. You understand? We. Not given too much wine. So when it's a giving too much wine, it means, it don't mean literal wine where you drink, it means philosophy. Read. Teachers of good things. What's it? Teachers of good things. So you have to teach your daughter or your son good things. Go on. That they may teach the young women to be sober, to love their husbands, to love their children. So we have to teach our we the elder woman and elder man have to teach the younger children to be sober. Teach the woman to love their husband and the children to be harder. It's important for us to bring out these rules. So when we bring it out, we have to train up a child in the way that he should go. So when he get old, he not depart from it. Because at the end of the day, he rooted and grounded. You know, you maybe want to go and sister, but here we know, we have our flyers. We'll get to you. Lord willing, the subscribe, we have two YouTube channels and you can get edification. Yeah? And <laughs> oh you repent, sister. No, I don't say it, sister. Eh? What the blood man and the water, sister? Alright, sister. Have a good alright. Alright, shall I want I want sister? Please be upon her. The book of Titus 9, Slacker, verse Timothy 2 and verse 9. In like manner also that women adorn themselves with modest apparel, with shamefacedness and sobriety, not with burning here, or gold, or pearls, or costly away. So we, we are saying, we sister them right now, they can anticipate up themselves with some hearts here in the bed, and do what them feel like though. You understand? The Lord said, you can look good. You can put on some things. And you don't carry yourself immaculate. But at the same time, don't put all emphasis on all of certain looks. Right? The looks come from what? Beauty is within. 
So yo, you have to the outside look like a rock marble, but inside are you pretty. Because you have good thought. Right? Read. This is Ephesians 5 and 26. That he might sanctify and cleanse it with the washing of water by the word. And this is the way we are going to clean up our people. By the word, not by dirty water. Right? Not by fine action on the water. Right. You can't clean up so you go down teeth, you come up back up bigger teeth. Right? So you have to cleanse yourself with the yes, word. Sir. That's right. Pastor is nothing but a listen man. A criminal. We call it as how it is. Can I push out the man and take people money when they go work hard for? Right? And even though people work so hard, but I push out half a pan. He want half a and yes, you have something to say though. Me see, uh, me never see it still. But at the end of the day, when we do my yard, Pastor keep church and Pastor birthday come. Sometimes I don't remember my birthday now. And somebody don't tell me my birthday. Pastor in my church, I tell everybody say, my birthday. Say my gift, right? And people have put that kind of money in a pan. My, 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 my ex, no ex, my baby mother, a hundred and fifty, you would keep on that part. That's the real thing. You know, so that hundred and fifty US would have buy me some good, um, frankincense and mule, and some good coal, to burn to me lad. Hundred and fifty US, fast I get out of one's money, right? So imagine where them put, because when them see that gun up there, they want to tap it off, and they want to pick up. Go over there, go over there. Give me Micah. Micah 6 and 8. Micah 6 and 8. Yeah, what do you want to do? Understand how the Bible read. Give me the book of Isaiah. Give me Isaiah chapter. Um, like a precept upon precept, right? Right. That's it. It's already Right, right, right. But then obviously, I'm not a master of Isaiah, man. So I don't know whether that is saying that we should go. That's why you need to listen. No, 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 no. I'm not. I'm listening. Yeah, I'm but you, 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 you say basically we, we, the context or read the Bible, you know, it doesn't mean that what we said. That's what you're saying, right? Yeah, what I'm saying is that. Why was that like that? Because the instruction for the woman then to be harder. Go back to go back to um, Titus. Because Titus, all of this book you see here is for the children of Israel. You understand? And these letters, what was written, was written unto us, the children of Israel. You understand? There was a routine for the old world and other nation, but to teach the children of Israel and other nation to get their judgment and then supposed to be in line. All right, never. Is it just judgment? It says something specific. What is it? Read. The grace, the chapter 2, the grace of our Savior has appeared to all men. So that simple being said. We the children of Israel, we are supposed to lead our nation because we are the nation where the Lord set up and top. Our nation means our nation, they mean to go to the heavenly father. Okay. And would that be people who are not Israel? All right, let me read. Give me, give me the book of Isaiah chapter 60. I'll start at uh, verse 12. 60, verse 12. 
Yeah. And give me the book of Isaiah chapter 2. And Isaiah. start at um, 2. Isaiah 60. Oh, Isaiah 60 and 12. Yeah. For the nations and the kingdom that will not serve thee shall yeah. perish. Will not the nations and the kingdom that will not serve thee shall perish. So the Lord says, do you understand that? Yeah, so, do you believe what it says? The nations and kingdom. Titus. That means her nation and her kingdom will not serve or shall perish. Read. Yea, those nations shall be utterly wasted. So any one of them who want to serve and lead the children of Israel shall be utterly wasted, my brother. So when the ear say, the heavenly father say, our nation, they must be under subjection. Are we not under subjection and need the core of them? Okay, so I get that there's just something no. Something bad. The Lord always have mercy on us. The people don't 
But him always have mercy for us. Give me Jeremiah, chapter uh, 31. I start at 34. and 34 and they shall teach no more every man his neighbor and every man his brother saying know the Lord for they shall all know me 35 35 31 35 31 35 thus saith the Lord which giveth the sun for a light by day and the ordinances of the moon and of the stars for a light by night. So you see, the ordinance. These are the stars, the moon, right, and the sun. These are ordinance three, which divided the sea. Uh -huh. When the waves thereof roar, uh -huh. the Lord of hosts is his name. Read. If those ordinances, if this, if those, if those ordinances depart from before me, uh -huh. said the Lord, then the seed of Israel also shall cease from being a nation before me forever. See that? So you see that? So the, the Lord never, ever put away Israel. You know what I'm saying? If the sun, the moon, the star departed, then Israel shall depart from being a before me forever. But I don't think you're saying that's wrong. Because if you see that at the end of the Which spoiled you, for he that toucheth 
you touch the apple of my eyes. Apple of the apple of my eyes. It's a children of Israel. You understand? Read Jeremiah 3 and 2. Jeremiah 3 and verse 2. Lift up thine eyes and... Jeremiah 2 and verse 3 Israel was holding his unto the Lord and the first fruits of his increase all that devour him shall offend evil shall come upon them evil shall come upon them saith the Lord verse 3 chapter 4 and verse 17 for the time is come that judgment must be big, it must begin at the house of Jehovah. He said judgment must go. Judgment must begin at the house of Jehovah. And if it first begin at us, what shall the end be of them that obey not the gospel of Jehovah? What is the gospel of Jehovah? I don't I, I, I agree. I agree with that. Yeah, definitely. I, I agree with this is the last This is the last for all. So basically, the heavenly father, the heavenly father said, give me the book of God. Um, and I'll show you something. And he said, um, 